This is Audiate. Audiate makes recording and editing your voice as simple as if you were editing text. As simple as editing text. Let me show you how it works. To start a recording, click the record button. Audiate captures everything you say, and as you speak, you'll see the words appear on screen. You might notice little mistakes here and there. Don't worry about them. Just keep on talking. And if you make a mistake, like, um, uh, uh, you forget what to say, um, yeah, simply keep on recording, and I'll show you how to fix those as well. To end a recording, sorry, to complete your recording, click the stop button. What you see now is your entire audio file typed out on the screen which you can edit just like text. For example, click and drag to select text you want to remove, then press delete on your keyboard to remove it. Or if you'd rather silence audio instead, make a selection and click the silence button. Silenced audio appears white, which indicates it won't play back as you preview and it won't appear in the final audio file. As you edit, if you find a word that Audiate didn't transcribe correctly, for example, up here I said the word Audiate. Select the word, then right click and choose one of the alternatives, or add in a custom word of your own. In this case, I'll select both words, then choose Combine into Custom Word. Scattered throughout the narration are these little dashes and dots. The dashes represent pauses, or areas of silence, and the dots represent ums and ahs, which we call hesitations. Like these. Like, um, uh, uh, you forget what to say, um, yet. To remove these hesitations, or areas of silence, click to select them, and press delete on your keyboard. Or, to remove all hesitations at once, go to Edit, Delete all hesitations. Sometimes, when you remove mistakes and hesitations, you lose the natural pause that falls between words, leaving the narration sounding a little unnatural. To add that pause back in, right-click a word and choose Insert Silence Before or After. This inserts a half second of silence that's represented by a dash. As you work in Audiate, Fine-tune your editing with the Waveform Editor. To open it, select a word and click this button. Or click the Waveform button at the bottom of the screen. The Waveform Editor presents a precise view of the audio waveforms, where you can zoom in and out to get a better look. Editing here is just like editing above. Use the words at the bottom to make quick selections, or Click and drag on the waveform to make a more precise selection. Then, hit delete to remove audio, or right click to see the full list of options. When you're completely finished editing, go to File, Export Audio. This exports the audio as a WAV file that's ready to use in Camtasia or wherever you use voice narration. To export the caption file to go along with it, choose Export Script. And if you want to take advantage of Audiate's simple editing features with your current voiceovers, choose Import Audio. Audiate transcribes the words and indicates areas of silence and hesitations so you can easily remove them. Well, that's all for now. We hope you enjoy Audiate, and thanks for watching.